So if you watched my first shard video two times opening, you saw that I got a cult brawler. I have to say, he has made such an impact on my clan boss team. So as you can see right now, he's got seven artifacts, four star, one five star, two five star, three five star, four five star. He's running with... Uh, an accuracy set, a uh, speed set for life, and a speed set normal. Um, he's got uh, no masteries and no books presently. Uh, the only thing that is activated is his um, passive because he's got four ascension stars. So there's him, and then compared to my Kale, who's got uh, all artifacts, um, full masteries, and I just want you to, to watch the clan boss uh, difference that he makes for my team. We will start with uh, normal level. So, before a cult brawler, on average, I was doing between four and four and a half million. It would take me one key to successfully get max rewards on the normal level. On easy level, because that's what I was doing, um, I would get um, probably about five million, five and a half million. And then when I would fight hard, I was um, successful at about three, three and a half million. And so, really, it was unrealistic for me to even remotely get. Um, top chest rewards in hard um, because it would take multiple keys and I wouldn't get the uh, use uh, for the other bosses or clan bosses. So, as you can see, uh, Cult Ballers 50. Um, my combination is uh, Frank, uh, of course, Apothecary. Tower. Tower is fully booked, so his uh, protection of zone hits every uh, four turns for two turns. Uh, right now he has the only three that have masteries. Uh, Apothecary has masteries, they're not full yet. Uh, Kale has full masteries. Frank has uh, mastery is not quite full yet. He's really close. I think he only needs a few more book, uh, a few more scrolls. Um, Brawler has none, and Tower has none. He's just really amazing. And the the neat thing about this, co the way I have the team set up, is um, of course. Uh, Kale is in lifesteal gear, and then Frank is in um, three sets of 3% turn gear. Tower is in a set that provides 10% gear, and uh, of course Brawler is not. He's in the speed and... Uh, accuracy set and so really when it comes to healing 
Uh, Apothecary only has to uh, throw up heals on Brawler. I have, uh, I'm stuck in dragons. Um, I think it is stage 16, if I'm not mistaken. It is the dragon stage where the uh, dragon is 200 void. And I thought, since... Uh, Occult Brawler is doing so well with me in Clan Boss already at level 50. I thought he would assist me with possibly uh, knocking over the dragon. And unfortunately, that is not the case. So, I'm still stuck at Dragon's Lair. Um, I will, of course, continue to try him out because he rated well for Dragon's. However, I'm going to focus on getting him up to 60, uh, getting his masteries up, um, look online to see how he's built, if he's built for um, support and defense, or if he's built for attack. Um, I'll have to see. Looks like a cult's gonna be saved by the zone. Apocathery hopefully will give him a nice big heal, which he does, but it's not full. Yeah, the zone of protection by tower really makes a difference in this group. Hopefully Apocathery gives himself a quick heal. Nope, that's it. We'll see how many times they're able to hold on. And then there was one. So as you can see, my team has successfully done 8.4 million damage now. So that's about a 3 million damage bump. And as you can already see, a cult brawler at level 50 is putting out close to 2.5 million um, the other opportunities that I have ran him in, I saw uh, three, three and a half million. So it varies between boss and, of course, defensive stature. But man, he is a beast. And if you have him and he is not in your clan boss, I highly recommend uh, upgrading and getting him in your clan boss to make an impact because he he is a, a force to be reckoned with um, clan boss he's perfect dragon's lair he rates a 4 8 and like I said I haven't got him up to 60 or anything as of yet um, and then of course gear wise I don't have him I should probably build him more as a tank and defense but I was trying to just cycle his turns and get him going. He's got, you know, 27,000 health and so forth. So, um, as usual, uh, if you have any questions, please leave them below. Um, if not, uh, this is Larry out.